Once upon a time, scientists thought that inheritance was all about blending. They figured that the traits got mixed up so that if a flower was red and another was white, their babies would all be pink. The rules of inheritance were worked out by a monk named Mendel. He figured them out by doing experiments with peas. He noticed that his plants were not mixing up their traits when they reproduced, and he wanted to know what was going on with that, so he carefully crossed pure breeding plants till he understood. The plants were getting one set of information from each parent. We call this information about a trait an allele. There was an allele for flower color from mom and one from dad. When a plant that has two alleles for white flowers is crossed with a plant that has two alleles for purple flowers, the children are all purple. We call this the F1 generation. You can think of it as the first cross. These plants have one allele for purple and one allele for white, but the purple allele seems to be stronger. We call it the dominant allele. The white allele only shows in the flowers if there are two of them, so we call it recessive. If you take those F1 babies with one of each allele and you cross them, you get three quarters of the children with purple flowers and one quarter with white. Only one fourth of this generation has two white alleles. One fourth also has two purple alleles, but they look the same as the plants with both kinds of alleles. Mendel also did work with other traits. He worked out the two laws of Mendelian genetics. Number one, each parent donates one of its two alleles randomly. Number two, each trait's alleles get donated independently of each other. These are the rules that helped build modern genetics.